love bugs is rosalind back at you one more again i hope everybody is doing blessed i'm doing blessed and highly favorite and definitely hope the same for you and if this is your first time stopping by my channel much love to you and welcome into my returning subs my grown extended beautiful family just thank you so much for the love and support um i missed y'all so much and i got so many downloads while i was gone and that's the reason why i had to take a break so with that being said much love to all namaste love and blessings love and light and many blessings are definitely coming your way and if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already please like and subscribe and even hit that notification bell so you know when your girl's about to upload the next video and if you are comfortable enough please drop a line or two i love a chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video or you just tell me about your empathic gift and how it impacted your life and heading you towards a positive direction also if you feel like the videos gave you good vibes or good information that you feel like another empath or you know anybody that you think is is uh going through that em empath knowledge that needs to hear it please go ahead and share and while you're at it give me a thumbs up like and even share on your social media favorites wherever you see fit and once again thank you so much for the love and support that you've been sending me as well as the channel and i hope you're able to resonate with the uh content of my video today y'all i'm listening to manifest your deepest desires law law of attraction let your desires flow to you and i will post that link in the description box below it has been you know um uh, y'all it's just going through it this last couple of days um i have to read some stuff to y'all because i want to make sure i'm getting <laughs> everything down so you will know um it's like a lot of us have been going through things and basically my my uh the content of my video say it's called twin flame 101 uh empaths is you know hayokas just regular empaths anybody who has empathic abilities are you going through the psychic flu or spiritual flu and you know i've, I've got this article down because i keep hearing that in my head you know different downloads come in and it's just certain words that like really you know stick out to me and it's like basically with i was telling a friend about it the other day you know she was like well i'm going through this and this and this and that and then when i kept on hearing you know spirit guys telling me you know psychic flu psych, psychic flu and she's like rosalyn what is psychic flu and it's like when we're going through major changes you know basically i had to give her you know a little snippet of what it is you're going through different changes it's like it means uh your body is clearing out old energy that is no longer needed and new lighter frequencies are taking work taking its place and um and it's like the 11 comic uh common spiritual flu symptoms ringing and buzzing of ears your body is adjusting to the higher vibration the ears tend to sense the first like uh the, this first like when you are on an airplane so you know like if you're going descending i mean ascending to different levels and stuff like that aches and pains all over your body oh gosh <laughs> i've been going through that because there are sometimes y'all see me doing this or like my legs get so stiff and i don't know if it's just because also i, I exercise like around 90 90 minutes a day um it's like your body is letting go of heavier dense energy that needs to be, needs to move out emotional outbursts which i've been going through a lot lately uh crying and anger your body is processing and letting go of old emotional energies that needs to clear out headaches and that's why i'm getting you know i'm dealing with right now it's like right where my third eye is it's really messing with me it says this is the third eye chakra opening to heighten intuition your whole head might hurt too again that in indicates the change of altitude and updating increase the sensitivity and empathy your intuitive gifts are expanding you're also uh you also might be tuning into uh the emotions and energies of others making sure make sure you you shield yourself a chain in uh sleep patterns you might sleep a lot or be wired i've been like that really hyper at some times it says outgoing out, outgrowing relationships over time you'll realize that lower vibration relationships don't serve you they might fall away naturally or they have a dramatic end crazy dreams oh jesus i've been getting apocalyptic dreams lately and i know it's because things are starting to shift for me but it's like really been getting crazy like i never 
you know, I can't really understand them. It says your sub, uh, subconscious might be processing and letting go of stored trauma. You also might be getting downloads of information, skin sensations. You might have hives or itchy, itchy skin for no reason. You might have tingling feeling in your body. Yes, I have been getting a lot of that. You might tune into your chakras and feel them vibrating as well. Um, feeling shattered and ungrounded. You might feel spacey in the head and even clumsy. <laughs> I've been doing that a lot lately. It says anything goes. Everyone experiences ascension differently. And this and this time might not look or feel anything like the last time. Honor your, your body and the needs. And it's telling you different things that you can do in case this does happen or when it does happen. Put your hand in the area over your chest. Your hand can rest on your, your skin or it can be uh, a few inches in front. Starting, uh, start massaging your heart chakra in, in a clockwise direction. While massaging your heart chakra, say, I deeply, completely love and honor and accept myself. I deeply, completely love and honor and respect myself. I open my heart chakra easily and effortlessly to give and receive love and compassion to myself and to others. I open my heart chakra easily and effort effortlessly to feel gratitude and forgiveness and joy. Repeat while massaging several times. Close your eyes and take a deep breath and affirm, I am love. And you know, we're all going through this right now. It's like we're preparing for whatever's coming. So it's like really putting us through some different daggone changes. And you know, I don't know why, but you know, like when Source tells me, hey, you need to tell them about this spiritual flu, psychic flu, because that's been coming through my head for the last two days. And that's the main reason why I had to take a break, y'all, because it was like I was getting so many downloads, and y'all see I was doing video after video after video. And I didn't realize for a whole month I've been doing this and only had like one or two days off. And I'm like, goodness, you know, I'm just, you know, doing what I have to do to help y'all, you know, basically break down the things that we're going through, things that might occur while we're going through this very dramatic shift. Going all through these different, you know, changes and different levels, you know, because I noticed the other day, you know, I had a friend that has been going through things and it's like, I noticed my gift has been very heightened. Like if there's somebody who can pass, that has passed on, especially if it's anybody that, uh, that you know has had a loved one pass on and they need that message to go to them it's like they're talking right dead in my ear like they're in the same room with me and it's just been very intense because i can feel the spirit of the loved one's emotions like during their transition and also the person that they're sending the message to and it's just like it got really intense and i knew this is the reason why i had to take that break because i knew i was going to have to go through something like this so it's been really draining but I feel really blessed and humbled to be able to help people. I tell them that all the time. I said, I love what I do. I love what I can be able to put understanding in people's hearts as well as minds. And know that you're not crazy. And I tell y'all this all the time. You're not crazy. You're not going through this alone. Even though there's times where we go through things and we feel like we're being punished. It's just a transition we have to go through. And it might take um, something like very traumatic to come in your life. You probably lost a loved one best friend, you know, spouse, you know, you could be going through divorce, um, lose a job, lose your home. You, I mean, you're going through so many different things that has to be tragic, but it's like to be able to filter everything out that is not needed anymore. You know, like Rosalind, I needed my job. Rosalind, I needed this house, but I understand that. Especially if I'm not going through it, you know, I, I don't know how you feel, but it's just to give you understanding on why this is happening. So it's like when we're going through all these things, it's filtering out everything that, you know, they're changing our lives for, for the better. It's just like when they're snatching things out of our lives, trust and believe they're about to replace it with something a lot better. So I'm not trying to hold y'all up. I'm going to go ahead and be making some more videos throughout the day uh, since I know it's like late in the afternoon. So you'll be getting uh, videos throughout the day and as well as night as well. As many things that I have going on, you know, I, I have to be, be able to tell y'all, look, this is what's going on with me. So you're probably having these things go, occur with you as well. So I'm not going to hold you up. Much love and light to everybody. Um, uh, let me give my spiritual shout outs to um, Diamond King, 
Empath P, uh, much love to you, the new people that are coming in and dropping lines to me. I greatly appreciate it. Uh, much love and light. You remember, drop me your line, give me a thumbs up, like and even share, and subscribe as well. And I would love to hear from you. Drop me a line, and I will talk to you later. Know that you are truly blessed, highly favored, and forever loved. And knowing there's always somebody out there praying for your better days. So much love to you. Peace. And have a great weekend. And be safe and responsible with everything you do. I'll holler at you later. Much love. Bye.